Well, hello there again, everybody. Tim here from Lessons on the Web, and I have something a little special here for you today. We're doing another piano lesson. Well, of course, what else would we do? But today we're doing something familiar, yet new, and I'll tell you what it's all about. So we are doing uh, the song Let It Go from Frozen. We're doing a walkthrough tutorial of it, but this time we're going to be using an app on my iPad. Of course, you can get the app too if you have a device that's compatible with iOS 8, and you can find this over on the App Store. Uh, the app is called SingSpiel, and what it really does is it listens to you play through the microphone and gives you feedback based on the pitches you hit and the timing in which you hit them. Uh, so a couple, uh, in a minute here I'll show you how the app works, but a couple of pieces of advice before we start is that if you choose to learn this song just through this video following along with me in the app, I highly suggest that you pause the video where needed, rewind the video wherever you need, and most importantly, if you go down to the little gear at the bottom of the video, at least that's where it is at this time uh, this video is being shot, you click on that and you can select the speed of the video, and if you click 0.5 or 0.25, you'll slow down uh, the video. So 0.5 is half speed and 0.25 is quarter speed. That might be a little bit too slow, but I highly recommend uh, 0.5 to help you follow along because the app goes at the actual speed the song is supposed to go so it goes pretty quick so it's pretty hard to keep up with both of us so I really recommend uh, that slow option on the video to make it a little bit easier to digest uh, or, or really learn the song I guess digest isn't the correct word when you're trying to learn something well it kind of is but anyway let me not ramble on uh, let's just get started remember the apps called sing spiel and you can find it on the app store and I'll show you how it works right now. All right, here we go.
let's see how I did. Okay, so after you're done the song, it calculates uh, how well you did of uh, your pitch and your timing. And let's see how well I did. I got 620 out of 794. That's not bad. Um, it's pretty picky on how well you do, so you really have to be accurate to get uh, anywhere close to 100%. So uh, let's see if you can beat my score. If you happen to get this app and uh, you beat my score and you can show me, uh, maybe I'll give you something special. Let me know. So if you have this app and you want to give it a try and you beat my score, show me and uh, yeah, I'll give you some kind of prize. So leave that in the comments if you would like. But anyway, that's uh, the playing portion. Let's just move on for the outro. All right, everybody, so that wraps up the lesson for today. So again, we went over the song Let It Go from the movie Frozen, but we used the Singspiel app along with it. So I have a couple of pieces of advice should you choose to get this app to make it um, easier to use. So one of the things I really suggest is that because the app moves at the full speed of the song along with the metronome and that little line that moves across the page, you couldn't really hear it in the video. Uh, the main part of the video, but there is a metronome that plays along with it. I suggest you turn up the sound on your iPad to max or really loud so you can really hear the beat to play along with it. That really helps. And if you're not familiar with playing along with the metronome, you can use the line on the page to guide you as well. Although I feel that you get a better score if you listen to the metronome. Now, they're, they're both in sync, but I always just felt for some reason I did better listening to the metronome and really syncing that up with my hands the best I could. Now one thing I really suggest you do when you first get this app, should you choose to get it, is when you first try to start playing these songs, uh, you want to uh, just try to get as many of the notes as you can. So you may want to break it down hand separate, like we've talked about before. Um, and you may just want to try to grab as many notes as you can on your right hand, play the, through the right hand like quite a few times, and then do the left hand quite a few times and then put them together and see how you do it. will take some practice, but it's kind of fun, in my opinion, seeing like how high of a score you can get. And like I mentioned in the video, if you can beat my score, I'll have a special prize for you. So uh, leave that in the comments, you know, a picture of it or something. Show me some kind of proof, and I'll have something special for you. But that's, of course, an optional thing. You can, of course, use the video to learn the song. And like I mentioned, those, those little things like pausing the video, going back, and playing the video at half speed are quite helpful. So again, the Singspiel app, I wanna thank the people at Singspiel, by the way, because they gave me full access to this app, which allowed us to really show you uh, not only how to play this song, um, but really, you know, what kind of apps are out there and what you can take advantage of, and just some of the features of the Singspiel app. So again, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments. Uh, thanks as always for listening, of course. Um, so have a great day and I'll see you for the next lesson. Thank you very much.